Welcome to tonight's edition of The Business Beat, sponsored by Royal Fidelity. Good evening, Bahamas. I'm Altafiz Munnings. Let's take a look at what's making business news today. The Nassau Airport Development Company, along with their key partners, the Atlantis Resort and the Nassau Paradise Island Promotion Bureau, preparing to host the fifth Roots Americas event. This year's Roots Americas event will be attended by more airlines and airports than any previous event, confirming Roots Americas' position as the largest commercial aviation event for the entire Americas region. Routes 20 to will run February 19th through 21st. The Caribbean Regional Compliance Association will hold a sixth annual Regional Compliance Conference in Trinidad next month. The Bahamian Contingent expects to offer a seller program to their regional compliance practitioners and a peer networking opportunity. The theme, Compliance, the Elephant in the Room, captures a mix of specialized compliance subjects. In international business, Italy, Spain, and Portugal are among a number of Eurozone nations to have their credit ratings lowered by Moody's. The agency also downgraded Slovakia, Slovenia, and Malta. Moody's also put France, Britain, and Austria on negative outlook, which implies there was a 30% chance of a downgrade in the next 18 months. And from regional business, the United Kingdom has pledged £75 million to assist with development projects within the Caribbean over a four-year period. The UK's commitment came out of talks at the 7th UK Caribbean Forum held in St. George's, Grenada in January. Remember, you can send us an email or join us on www.znsbahamas.com or become our friend on ZNS's official Facebook page. And that will end tonight's edition of The Business Beat, sponsored by Royal Fidelity. Thanks so much for watching. I'm Altavis Munnings. Thank you.